Hello everyone, I'm Drew Delisio, the Director of Counseling Services at Good Dads. Good Dads is a nonprofit organization headquartered in Springfield, Missouri, dedicated to helping kids one dad at a time. We do this by resourcing, encouraging, and inspiring dads from all walks of life to be more involved in the lives of their children. Let's get started with 10 things you probably didn't know about Good Dads Counseling. Number one, Good Dads Counseling falls under the Good Dads umbrella, but our counseling services are open to everyone. I can't tell you how many times I've experienced this. People will hear about Good Dads Counseling and automatically go, I'm not a dad, so this doesn't apply to me. I always try to clear up their confusion. Good Dads Counseling Services aren't just for dads. As a counseling center, we are open to anyone, including individual sessions, but we specialize in couples and family therapy. Number two, speaking of couples, perhaps you were unaware that when the woman in a heterosexual relationship seeks couples counseling, the couple has a much stronger chance of thriving compared to when the man calls. While not all couples who seek therapy are doomed to fail, it is certainly the case that whoever calls for counseling makes a huge difference. If the wife calls for counseling, there's actually a much better chance that a marriage can be saved. That's because men tend to wait too long. By the time they wake up to the fact that their wife is terribly unhappy and on her way out the door, it's often too late. So if you're a guy and you think your relationship with a woman may not be in good shape, don't wait. It can make a big difference to your future. Number three, men in particular can benefit from counseling. People are surprised to learn that one in 10 men experience some sort of depression or anxiety, and less than half of them seek help. Good Dads Counseling strives every day to make counseling more equitable among men and women. We have a welcoming environment that appeals to all kinds of men, which is critical these days, where men are socialized to keep their feelings to themselves, avoid seeking help, or isolate themselves from others. Number four, counseling is especially helpful for people who are adjusting to a new chapter in their lives. It's a common assumption that therapy is only for people who have a history of mental health issues, but that doesn't really paint the full picture. In reality, everyone can benefit from therapy. Studies have shown this to be true, and I've found it to be true in my own observations in meeting with my clients. Counseling is particularly effective for people going through a big life transition. Say that you are a recent high school graduate and aren't sure about your next steps, or say you and your partner are pregnant and you're about to start a family. Maybe you're an empty nester and aren't sure what to do now that the kids have all grown up. We all know that life moves pretty fast, whether you're getting a new job, grieving the loss of a loved one, getting married or divorced, or anything else that life might throw at you. We encourage you to consider visiting with Good Dads Counseling for any of life's big moments. Number five, Good Dads Counseling often uses a family systems focus to help families reach their goals. Family systems theory is the idea that your family has a large scale impact even outside family matters. Science says that your family, the context they're embedded in, The connections between family members and how they interact with each other, their behaviors and emotions, the whole complicated family system can shape rules, beliefs, and values. This means families who celebrate each other and help one another through tough times are healthier, more stable, more loyal, more resilient, and are overall better off both as a family and as individuals. When we use this theory in counseling, it means families can identify patterns to help them attain better lives. Number six. We use a strengths-based approach in our services. Strengths-based therapy is a type of counseling that focuses on someone's internal skills and resourcefulness instead of focusing on their shortcomings or weaknesses. We have found that a strengths-based approach means our clients have a more positive mindset, are more resilient, and are often more optimistic. This way, people can become better problem solvers and can reach goals themselves with the counselor's guidance instead of us just telling you what to do. Number seven. Good Dads Counseling doesn't just use one theory or system in our services. Our counselors pride themselves on their flexibility. We use an integration of several different approaches and we can cater our services to each client so everyone is getting something truly unique out of their session. For instance, some people are partial to cognitive therapy or have specific religious beliefs that work well with them. In other words, we can use whatever tools you particularly want to help you reach your goal. This can also mean you don't have to come to our offices for therapy. We welcome phone and Zoom sessions. We want to do whatever works for you. Number eight, our minds and bodies are connected. Poor mental health can lead to poor physical health and vice versa. In fact, poor mental health raises the risk for other illnesses, 
like heart disease, diabetes, stroke, and cancer. Furthermore, if you have a long-term physical health condition, the likelihood of mental health issues increases too. Number nine, we are private pay, which means we do not take insurances, but our services are based on a sliding scale, which goes off of your income. We know that not everyone can afford to pay a therapist hundreds of dollars an hour, and with the cost of everything going up, counseling may seem like a luxury. In a state with a poverty rate of 12.7%, Good Dads is committed to offering affordable services. And finally, number 10, you can still benefit from Good Dads Counseling even if you aren't seeing our counselors. If counseling isn't right for you right now, that's okay. We still have access to free mental health resources on our website, gooddads.com. We have podcasts, articles, and other free resources. I particularly want to direct you to the Men in Mental Health blog, Each month, we have a collection of essential blog posts on a different mental health topic, so there's always something new to learn. Whether you are a man, you love a man, or if you are raising a child to become a man, you'll get a lot from the Men and Mental Health blog.